Before you build your project, you need to set up the paths to your include files and libraries, and you could optionally modify compiler settings and other settings. You do this from your project properties. For example, in this project, I have a reference to pound include dry.h, which is inside the ink folder. There are two ways I could handle this. The first way would be to modify this line to just say that this file lives in the ink directory. The second way to do that is to specify that the ink folder, uh, where the ink folder lives in my include file paths. And I'm, I'm going to do that. You do that by right clicking your project and selecting properties. Then you're going to expand the CC build option and select settings. From here, I can do things like modify my board. So for example, if I stop, want to stop using the simulator and actually use a real board, I could change that. I can change all my board properties as well. I'm going to go under Source Recode Bench C Compiler and select Includes and add the path to my include file to this project. And because the directory is in my workspace, I'm just going to select Workspace, Ink. If the, my include files were someplace outside of my project or outside of my workspace, I would come in here and select File System and then browse to where that is. From here, I can also do things like add optimization flags for the compiler, debugging options. Another common thing that you might want to do is add library search paths, and if you have shared libraries or external libraries, add them in here. When you're finished making changes, click Apply, and then click OK to close the dialog box. Now we're ready to build our project.